Hello, guys. Welcome. Hi, Carlita Veronica. Hi, teacher. Hello, good evening. <laughs> Fine. Are you ready for action? Uh, <laughs> mm. Yes. <laughs> yes, you're ready for action. I like it. All right. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to show you the, the agenda. All right, just to be ready. All right, sure, sure, we have different points to cover. So basically, this is what we're going to do today. Agenda, okay? So okay. you're the winner, number one. I like it. You're on time. Excellent. Number one, Carlita Veronica. You're the winner. Estaba viendo si hacía los ejercicios ahorita también. <laughs> okay, okay. That's good. Okay, let's start this. It's going to be tribal class in this moment. Okay, Carlita, let's start together. Okay. Okay. Uh, agenda. Okay, so read the five different activities, please, for me. Okay. Uh, Rob Mop, Teddings, personal information. Practice city. Practicing. No, practicing. 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 Practicing, useful conversation using wall like two. Perfect. Practicing conversation using Good. call for polite requests. Pol polite requests. Polite. Polite requests. 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 Correct. Okay. Practic practices conversation. Using call for light request. 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 Correct. Creating. Create. 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 Create and conversation using call. Perfect. And number five. Wrap up. Perfect. All right. Hello, Alice. Hello, teacher. Welcome again. Thanks. Aquí que estoy poniéndome disque el día. <laughs> es que okay. entré tarde, pero bueno, aquí estoy ya. No, no worry, you are on time, okay? I like it. Okay, objective. Alice, the objective. Okay. Um, to put in practice, what well, like to and calling. Cool. And cool. 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 Informal request in conversation. Perfect. All right, guys. Excellent job. That's okay. Basically, the five activities that we're gonna cover today. So the first one, telling personal information, like it says in the agenda right here. Activity number one is a warm up. So that's what we're gonna do. Telling personal information. Vamos a decir eso. So here we go. Okay. I'm gonna put you in two. The room right now. Lo voy a poner en el cuarto. Hello, Adrian. Welcome again. Thank you. Good All night. Right. Good night, all. <laughs> we were waiting for you. Okay, Adrian. I was telling, okay, uh, Carlita and Alicia that we're going to practice this in this moment. We're going to okay. practice this. Okay? Okay. All right, here we go. I, I want to... I'm going to put you into the rooms. Lo voy a poner en, en, la, en las sesiones, okay? Del cual, ahí en mm. la habitación, in this moment. So it's only you, only one, okay? I'm going to create right now. Van a trabajar en grupo en este momento. Action. Okay, okay, that's good. Perfect. All right, guys, so what the students are doing right now, they are basically practicing uh, this activity, telling okay, their personal information. Uh, in today's um, activity, they are practically telling also the description of their city they live in, all right? 
So, Elizabeth, hello, Rose, how are you, Roxana? Hello, Roxy and Elizabeth, welcome. Hello, hi. Okay, what happened to you, teacher, yesterday? I have a, a work, a cute, a new user, students. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, that's good, that's good. Oh, there is, okay, Ana Maria Alvarado in this moment. All right, perfect. That's good, that's good. I'm gonna stop the, the session in this moment, okay, to include you to the rooms. Just let me see. The others, okay, uh, Adrián, Alicia, and Carlita are practicing to the room, but in this moment I stop the activity, all right, to push you also into the rooms. So what activity are we doing? This one. This is the activity that we're doing in this moment, Roxy, Elizabeth, and also Ana Marie. All right? This is what we're doing. Okay? So we're gonna wait for Elizabeth. If you don't have it, take a picture, all right? Because we're gonna practice this activity, telling this information. Okay, 20 seconds, they are still practicing, all right? So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, Elizabeth, yesterday we were practicing this. Uh, the information that is in blue, lo dice si vives en la ciudad. Uh, the information that is in black, lo dice si vives así como en, una, en un pueblo, o, okay? Rural. De, yes, rural, okay? okay? Correcto, okay? Like that. So here we go. Okay. My personal information. All right, I wait. <laughs> okay, guys, I stopped the activity because, okay, here we have Roxy, Ana Maria, and also Elizabeth. So I'm gonna put you into the rooms one more time. Lo voy a poner en los salones, okay? In pairs oh, in this okay. moment. I'm okay. gonna put you in pairs. Okay, Teacher. Too. Yes? Eh, teníamos una, bueno, yo tengo una duda. Eh, mi primer clase de One by One no pude ingresar, primero porque no había descargado el, el, el correo, que okay. en esta vez eh, de 10 y, 10 y 10 a 10 y 20. Eh, ah, después eh, traté de ver el correo, pero eh, entendería que hay un horario establecido, pero no puedo verlo, no me deja descargar el horario, entonces por eso fue que la otra vez tampoco no, no sabía. Eh, si me dijeron, vaya, de tales horas a tales horas. Ahora mismo quisiera saber si tengo una hora establecida, si me toca a mí o si no, pues para dejar pasar. I don't no know. puedo ver el horario. I don't know, porque uh, yo creo que ya les enviaron quién va a estar este día. Si no es... me han enviado a mí. Lo que pasa es que ese correo lo enviaron casi que al inicio. O sea, ellos no están enviando dos, tres, cuatro veces el mismo correo, sino que lo enviaron una sola vez y esa vez te decían, a ti te va a tocar tal día. Y por ejemplo, Pero, imagínate que a mí, este, si me pongo a revisar ahorita el correo, porque ahorita no me recuerdo en la fecha en que me llegó, pero sí tengo como tres semanas de haberlo visto, donde decía que a mí me tocaba el 26 a las 10 y 10. Entonces, por Alicia. Eso, Alicia. Eh, que, que, que yo estaba tratando de ver, o sea, de descargar ese horario para que ver. Para Pero es, ver que no, que, es que no tenés que descargar, solo tenés que entrar a tu cuenta, a tu correo electrónico y es visible. O sea, ahorita yo, te, yo voy a tomar una captura de imagen y te la voy a mandar al, al grupo de WhatsApp para que lo veas. Así tal cual, o sea, solo lo que he hecho es abrir mi correo electrónico y luego... Este, ¿cómo se llama? Abrir el día en que me tocaba, eh, bueno, que, que llegó ese correo, más bien dicho, donde informaban lo, lo, ese punto. Okay. Ahorita estoy mandando. Yes. Ahí está. Sí, yes. sí, yes. correcto. Entonces, eso, ese y correo lo mandaron que... el 29 del 7, o sea, de julio estamos hablando. Ajá. Lo enviaron a las 10 y 31 según mi correo. <risa> y, y entiendo que nos toca una y sola vez al mes. Exacto, es una vez al mes. Correcto. Ese no lo pude, bueno, entonces entendería que no me toca a mí. Ese no lo pude, no lo pude. ¿qué, ¿No pudiste qué? abrir tu correo? No, vaya, eh, yo, a mí me, me llegó el correo, eh, pero ese, ese es correo electrónico, email. Sí, ese es mi correo. Este. Lo que pasa es que cada, como cada empresa destina, 
Bueno, por ejemplo, en el caso del Colegio Champañat, nosotros tenemos un correo institucional, todo el personal. Entonces, nosotros para unirnos a estas clases lo que hicieron es utilizar el correo institucional. Entonces, todo cae a, ese, a ese, esa cuenta de correo. Eh, no sé si en tu caso, eh, si hay un equipo más ah, grande no o solo eres tú y tú solamente estás gestionando, entonces tú diste un correo electrónico. That's correct, Adrián. Sí, sí, no, en el, en el mismo only one un correo. Time. It's all, only one time in a month, solo una vez. Only one Ten time. Minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Correct. Entonces, entonces no me toca este día porque ya me tocó anteriormente. That's correct, that's correct. Okay. All right, here okay. we go. Hey, disculpen por <laughs> that's okay, Adrian. That's okay. Okay, guys, I'm gonna put you into the rooms. That's the activity that you're gonna do right now. You're gonna be telling that information. Van a decir esa información, okay? So here we go. Okay. Action. Go, go, go. Thank you, Alice, for the information. Hello. Hello, hello. Okay, click on the invitation, Adrian. Go and practice. Excellent. Woo, here we go. Let's share. Let me see Alicia Roxy, okay? And Ana Marie Claudita. Okay, this one. I'm gonna go and check on these girls. La que es de toda la información. Okay. Ajá. Esa, esa, esa. Vaya, la ven o la hago más la grande. No, así está bien. La más grande, no, yo no veo. Vaya, Vaya. Vaya. Bien. ¿Cómo nos vamos a distribuir la práctica? Primero digo yo. La parte roja, luego alguien más dice el azul y después la otra vuelve a decir la roja y así. Y ahí yo digo el azul y así, ¿me entiendes? Me explico. Ok. Eh, ¿tú, ¿Tú comienzas entonces, Claudia? Comienzo yo, bueno. Hi, good night. My name is Claudia. So live in Usulután. It's a small, fresh, and, and it's surra surrounded by mountains. And there you can see a soccer field, an antique shoe called where it rivers and water falls, as well as tiny, typical food like empanadas and or famous pupusas. There are no bars. Café o discote, but we celebrate uh, local festi festivities, and my town is compact and we don't have pollution. In hey, Clarita, my... one more time, one more time, otra vez. Ahí tienes la pronunciación, ¿ok? Sí, Ahí... pero es que no la veo. One more time, one more time. Pues... <laughs> no, 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 no. Here we go, again, action. It's action. <laughs> Street, call it Paseo del Carmen, where you can, where you can find, find a restaurant, cafes, discotheques, bars, and the other kind of entertainment like living statues. No. Uh, in my breakfast, I have eggs, cheese, fried beans, and I drink beer coffee. For my lunch, I have chicken or fish or meat. 
with rice and salad and I drink a Coke. Uh, for my dinner, I have beans, fried beans, fried bananas, uh, eggs, and cream. And I drink a coffee. Besides, I would me and my work. I am a bank employer and I work in a bank. So I work for a bank El Salvador is is a this is music. Also my like and this like I like dancing, I like eat, I like sleep, uh, but, uh, but I don't like um, melon, uh, tamarindo. So frequency work, I work say that usually, I usually send report, I never do the payroll, I occasionally plan activities, and I sometimes organize meetings. Organize meetings and besides some of my obligation during the week are um, um, on Monday, I have, uh, I have, I see it, I have, I have the call clients. Um, Thursday, uh, I have to, I, I have, have to. to, thank you. I have to send um, check and say emails and on uh, I have to <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay organize meeting um, I am very very friendly see friendly yeah and sociable I'm very friendly and social person. I really like to make friends everywhere. Yes. And, and I know, let me tell um, you some, some, yeah, you some information about my favorite really. Ay, la tía se me olvidó olvidar. Relative, correcto. Relative. Relative. Era... Ay. Ay, teacher, lo siento, es que no repasé. Ay, <risa> right, really, really, no hay problema. Um, luego, finally, just some information about my favorite. I know. Finally, I, if for one to compare. Contact me. This is my email address, Alicia Handel uh, at yahoo.com. Perfect. Well, that's all I can tell you. Yeah. That's good. Much better. I like it. Next. Next. <laughs> Correct. Okay. subir. All right, right, here we go. I'm gonna check on Adrian here. Ahora seguiría alguien más. Hi. Okay. Hi, good night. My name is Anna. So I live in Usulutan. Disculpe. Hi. Hi. Good night. My name is Anna. I live in Usulutan. Uh, it's small, fresh, and sun run by mountains. mountains. And there are mountains. Mountains. ¿Qué le pasa a esto? Mountains. 
Are there you can find a soccer file in soccer field. soccer field soccer field soccer field in antique church antique church oh, antique church called water rivers and what it's fast and well as trying typical food. waterfalls 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 <laughs> as well as trying typical food uh, like empanadas and our famous famous Fe pupusas. famous 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 pupusas there are no bars cafes or discotheques but we celebrate local local festivities and my town is compact and we don't have pollution perfect and uh, in, in my breast breakfast, I have beans and bread, and I drink coffee. For my lunch, I have rice and cheese, and I drink water. For my dinner, I have um, bananas fried, fried bananas. Uh, beans, fried bananas. Beans, bana, be, uh, fried beans. Perfect. And I drink coffee. Besides, about me and my work, I am executive and I work in bank. So I work for Atlantida Bank. Perfect. Well, next. My, next. Well, my, next. Okay. Next. Next. Excellent. Next. Excellent. <laughs> well. Well, well, that's, I can't tell you. Okay. Wednesday, I sent, sent report. Um, Thursday, I do the aisle. On Friday, I have two cold clients. Um, I am a very friendly and sociable person, and I really like to make friends everywhere. And now, let me tell you some information about my favorite relative. She is my grandmother. Her name is Laura. She is 79 years old and she lives in Santiago, Texas. Finally, if you want to contact me, this is my email address, roxana.cornejo at gmail.com. Well, that's all I can tell you. All right, all right, so excellent job. The students that we're doing right now, they were telling, okay, information to each other. That was really good. Really, really good. Just waiting for them right now. They were into the rooms. All right, Carlita, little by little, step by step. Yeah, you have the powers. <laughs> I don't hear you, I don't hear you. <laughs> All right, Anna Marie, little by little. Okay, Alice is back. Okay, guys, excellent job. Welcome one more time. Okay, so basically, Okay, that's the activity that we were doing. I'm gonna share the screen one more time. So this is what we finished, telling this information to each other. Okay, so there were some, okay, you, some of you that were 
Okay, joining us, okay, a little bit late. Okay, Catherine, please, welcome. Okay, and also I saw Billy over there. Billy, Billy, no Billy. Okay, no Billy, Billy. Okay, no, I don't see Billy. And Omar, okay. Omar, welcome. And Catherine, please, this. Next activity, we have this one. This conversation using would like to, okay? Vamos a poner a Catherine Pleites in this moment. And Anita, action. Catherine Pleites and Anita. Okay. Hello, can I help you? Yes. I, I'd like to have some love. Would you like us to stretch? Como se, como, how do you say, teacher? Stutter. Yes, I'd like a bowl of chicken soup, please. And what would you like for our main course? Perfect. I'd like a grilled, grilled grill. cheese grill. sandwich. Grill. Grill. I'd like grilled cheese sandwich. Would you like anything to drink yes i'd like a glass of food please can i bring you anything else no thank you just a bill certainly 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 pardon certainly i don't have my glasses how much is the lunch that six seven five. Here you are. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a good day. Thank you. That's up to you. That's correct. All right now, Elizabeth and Omar. Thank you, Catherine and Anita. Okay. Elizabeth and Omar. Hey. Hello. Hey. Hello. Can I help you? Yes. I like to have some lunch. Would you like a starter? Yes, I like a bowl of chicken soup, please. Soup, soup, soup. soup. Uh, what you what soup. would you like for a main course? Perfect. I like a grilled cheese sandwich. Grill, 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 grill. Would you like anything to drink? Excellent. Yes, I like a glass of coke, please. Uh, can I bring? King? Can I bring? Can I bring? Uh, can I bring you anything else? No, thank you. Use the bill. Certainly. Certainly. I don't have my glasses. How much is the lunch? That's a. That's Six, six, seventeen dollars. Six dollars seventy five or six seventy five. Six seventy five dollars. Here you are. Here. Thank you very much. Here you are. Here. Here. Here you are. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a good day. Thank you. The sound to you. The same, the same. The same. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now, this one invitations. Okay. Vamos a practicar esta conversación. Invitation conversations. Okay, yes. utilizando el would like to. Yes, tell me. Um, Podría explicar sobre en qué momento se usa el I like to. Y veo que en algunas se usa con el tú y hay veces que no. Ok, ok. Ahorita mismo. Ok, vamos a ir acá otra vez. Back. Ok. Here. Ok. I like to have. ¿Cuándo, utilizamos con, ¿Cuándo lo utilizamos con el tú? Buena pregunta. Lo utilizamos cuando hay otro verbo. Ok, ahí es cuando utilizamos I like to have. Aquí tenemos otro verbo. ¿Cuándo no lo utilizamos? Cuando no utilizamos otro verbo. Ok, cuando hay un sustantivo. Ok, I like that. Esa sería la explicación. I like to have some lunch. 
I would like a starter. I like a bowl. Okay. I like for uh, what would you like for my course? I like a grill. Okay. Would you like anything else to drink? Okay. I like a glass. Okay. So, prácticamente solo una vez se utilizó aquí. Y esa sería la explicación. Roxy? Sí. Sí, y, y en tercera persona el verbo se, manten, se haría como tipo present o, o ya no cambia por la S. Correcto, ok. Uh, yes, that's a good question, ok. So, for example, when you say she, ok, would like, ok, este verbo de acá no cambiaría, no se le tendría que poner una S, nada que ver. All right. No se le tendría que poner nada. ¿Por qué? Porque este es un auxiliar. Y cuando se utiliza un auxiliar, el verbo tiene que ir en presente. No tiene que ir en tercera persona. No tiene que ir así. ¿Ok? Present. Present. Presente. Presente. En presente. Eh, she would like, también aquí, she would like to have. En ningún momento tampoco vamos a poner ese verbo en tercera persona, ¿ok? Tendría que ser siempre en presente, en la base for, base form, ¿ok? Roxy? Yes, 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 that's okay. Any other question? All right, perfect, good question, buenas preguntas, ¿ok? ¿Alguien más? No, ok. Yo, teacher. Yes, yo. Yes, Omar, tell me. Tengo... Tengo una consulta para yes. decir, por ejemplo, eh, ¿cuál sería la forma de decir 675, pero en este caso? O sea, lo, usualmente nosotros decimos 675, ¿verdad? Para uh -huh. referirnos a dólares, ¿qué es eso? Pero la forma correcta es 6 dólares con 75. Yeah, you can say pero, uh -huh. Yes, go ahead. Pero la forma correcta de decirla, ajá, uno lo puede decir así, 675 en inglés. Six dollars seventy-five. Yes, yes, you can say it. Six dollars seventy-five. It's six dollars seventy-five. That's okay. six dollars seventy-five. Yes, not a problem. Oh, okay. That's good. Any other question? No. No. Okay, guys. Let's continue. The next one is this one. Invitation conversations. Okay. Vamos a utilizarlo también para decir would like to. ¿Ok? Ahí está la explicación que Roxy quería. Aquí hay un verbo, por eso se utiliza would you like to go. ¿Ok? Ahí está en medio de esta conversación la estructura would you like to go. ¿Ok? Like that. Buena pregunta. Muy buena, muy buena ese punto que tú hiciste. ¿Ok? ¿Cuándo se utiliza el would like to? ¿Cuándo no se utiliza? Let's continue. ¿Cómo se... Let's, ¿Cómo, se yes. traduciría, ¿Cómo se traduciría entonces, would you like to go? Excelente, ok. Would you like significa te gustaría. Solo would you like significa te gustaría ir. Ir. Correcto. Ok. Te gustaría ir, ok. Would you like to drink. Otro verbo, would you like to drink, le gustaría beber. Would you like to visit, le gustaría visitar. Ok. Would you like to watch, le gustaría ver. Ok. Elizabeth? Okay, gra sí, gracias, teacher. Perfect, perfect. All right, good questions. I like it. Eso bueno, cuando hacen preguntas, muy bueno porque va para todos, ok? En esa explicación. All right, guys, let's practice this conversation. It's about invitation. This is the format for any invitation. Este formato es para cualquier invitación, ok? Y ya lo van a ver, lo vamos a practicar. So we're going to have this conversation with... All right, Elizabeth, como estuvo docente, la vamos a poner Elizabeth en Rubidia. Hey, Josué, welcome. Hi, Rubidia, how's it going? Uh, very good. What you? Nothing. You salute. You salute of work. Of work. Yes. I can uh, imagine. I can imagine. I listen. Do you help them with people? No at all. Okay. Well, Pronunciation, yes. Elizabeth. No at all. 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 Correct. Wait, what you asked? Uh, 
¿Se ve bien? Like invite you. you. I like to invite you. I like to invite you to a, a sport event. Event. To like event. Event. Would you like to invite us to a sport event? Would you like to go? Sure. I don't have anything to do on the weekend, but uh, that gig of what kind? What kind? What kind? Thing? About okay, continue, Elizabeth. What kind of sport event is it? Of a sport event, it's about martial arts. Martial arts. That sounds is interesting because I have never been to one of those events. 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 So, will you go with me? Yes. We do we meet? Well, the event. <laughs> the event, the event, the event. The event is in this event next Saturday at 4 p.m. So, when do you see this group there? Perfect. I I'll, I'll, I'll. Perfectly, I'll be there and thanks for inviting me. Thank you, okay, my friend. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay, Ruidia, ahí está en una dimensión desconocida. ¿no? <laughs> amazing, amazing, amazing. Okay, here we go. Now we're going to put, okay, um, Josué. Uh, Josué. And Claudia, action. Claudia, action. Hi, Josue. How's it going? I'm pretty good. What's new? Not me. Just a lot work. I can imagine. Hey, listen. Do you have plans next weekend? Not a lot. Not a lot. Why do you ask? I like to invite invite you to in, a sport in, event. Invite you, invite you, invite you. Otra vez. I like, I like to invite you to a sport event. Invite you, invite you, invite you. Otra vez. I like to invite you to a sport event. Would you like to go? Sure. I don't have anything to do on the weekend. But what kind? Of what kind? What kind? What kind? What kind of sport event it is? Is it? It's it. about martial art. That song is That sounds. That sounds. That sound, sounds. That, that sound is interesting. No, because interesting. I interesting. Interesting. <laughs> That sounds interesting because I have never been in one of those events. So, will you go with me? So, so will you go with me? Perfect. Yes, where do we meet? Where do, where we, do meet? we meet? Okay. Yes, well, the event is in event. In the, event. Well, the event is event. in event. Event. Even no event. Event. Well, the event is no. in, in event. Even no event. 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 Okay. Well, the event. No is event. Event. <laughs> Uh, well, the event is in Indus next Saturday at 4 p.m. So, what do you think if we meet there? Yes. Perfect. I will tell and say thanks for inviting me. Inviting me, correct. Anytime, my friend. Goodbye. See you next 
step by step. All right, that's good. Little by little, step by step. Now, Roxy, in Spanish and in English, action. English and Spanish. Hi. Hi, how's it going? Hola, ¿cómo estás? I'm pretty good. What's new? Estoy muy bien. ¿Qué hay de nuevo? Nothing. Just a lot of work. Nada, solamente mucho trabajo. I can imagine. I can imagine. Puedo imaginarlo. Hey, listen. Do you have plans next weekend? Eh, escucha. ¿Tienes planes para el fin de semana? No, 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 no. Correcto. No, para uh -huh. nada, no en lo absoluto. Ok. Eh, no te eh, Why you ask? ¿Por qué preguntas? I like to invite, invite, invite you. Invite you, invite you, invite you. Invite you. Invite you. I like to invite you eh, to a sport event. 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 Yes. event. Okay. To a sport event. Me gustaría invitarte a un evento deportivo. Would you like to go? ¿Te gustaría ir? Sure, I don't have anything to do on the weekend. No, seguro no tengo nada que hacer el fin de semana. But what kind? Pero ¿de qué tipo? Of a sport event. Is it, es un evento deportivo. Eh, ¿Qué tipo? Eh, ¿qué, de qué, What tipo? Kind? ¿Qué tipo de evento deportivo es? Ok. It's about martial arts. I don't know what is martial Artes marciales. Ok, es de artes marciales. What sounds interesting? That sounds, that sounds. That sounds interesting. Interesting, interesting. interesting. That sounds interesting. Interesting. Eh, Interesting. 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 Perfect. That sounds interesting. Eh, suena muy interesante because I have never been in one of those event, events. Yes. Eh, porque yo nunca he eh, estado en, en, esos? En, en esos eventos. En, en esas actividades. Correcto. So, will you go with me? Eh, ¿Te gustaría ir conmigo? ¿Irás conmigo? Ah, irás conmigo. Yes, where do we meet? Sí, ¿dónde nos reunimos? Perfect. Well, the event is in Indes next Saturday at 4 p.m. Bien, el evento es en el Indes, el este próximo sábado a las 4 de la tarde. So, what do you think if we meet there? ¿Qué, qué piensas si nos reunimos allá? Perfect. Eh, I'll be there in, in thanks for inviting me. Perfecto. Eh, nos vemos allá. Estar, ahí estaré. Hoy estaré en gracias por invitarme. Anytime, my friend. Goodbye. Eh, cuando quieras, mi amigo. Bye, adiós. And see you next Saturday. Te veo el siguiente sábado. Bye. Excellent. Okay, guys. Preguntas. Yes, all the powers. <laughs> little by little. Okay, guys. Questions. Tienen preguntas. Acerca de pronunciación. Remember, here is invite you. I like to invite you, invite you. No at all. I say aquí, no at all. I can imagine. All right. I can imagine, no at all. I like to invite you. Y esta palabra, ¿ok? La estamos pronunciando casi que en español. Event. Event, all right? Event. Event. Ok, no. In English is event. Event. All right. Event. All right, perfect. Okay, eh, la otra que nos estaba dando duro era inviting me, inviting me. Thanks for inviting me. All right, guys, we're going to practice this conversation. Lo vamos a practicar in groups in this moment. So take a picture. One, two, 
three, four, five. Take a picture. Are you ready? Here we go. Okay, guys, I'm gonna put you into the room right now. We are 11, I like it, all right, boom. Okay, let's go to, okay, what is, okay, here. Okay, let's go to the rooms. I'm gonna create one more time. One, two, three, four, five. Recreate, initiate, okay? Click on the invitation, practice the conversation. Action. Lo vamos a practicar en grupos. Action, action. Okay. There you go. Okay, that's good. Gonna move here. Then I'm gonna move to Lydia here. Perfect, that's good. All right, I'm gonna go and check on them. Lizabeth, okay, here. I am pretty good, what do you Nothing, as a love or war. I can't imagine. I can't. I listen. I can't, I can't. I can't imagine. Hey, listen. Did you have planned this weekend? No at all. With you art. It's light, invited, invite to you do a uh, sport event. Where you like to go? Event, event. Event. Excellent. Aquí es yeah. event. I like event. it. Ooh, Where you like to go? <laughs> sure. I don't have anything to go on the weekend, but that. King of sport. Kind, even kind, kind. King, no, kind. Okay, what kind of sport event is it? Is it? What kind of sport event is it? Event is it? Okay, event is it? Perfect, Carlito. Is about martial art. Excellent. That's all intro, intro, interesting. 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 Thank you, Elizabeth. <laughs> That's all interesting because I have never oh. been in one of their events. Yes. So, where do you go with me? Yes. Where, where do we meet? Where do we? Where do we? No way. Okay. <laughs> yes. Where do we meet? <laughs> <laughs> little by little, little by little, Carlita. Don't worry. Poco a poco. <laughs> well, the evening <coughs> is event, event, event. Well, the event is in Indes next Saturday at. 4 p.m. So what do you do think if we make that? Perfect. Perfect. All there. Um, thanks for inviting me. <clears throat> okay. okay, my friends. Goodbye. Okay. Excellent. See you next Saturday. Bye. Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Next, next, next. But what kind of or event is it? It's about martial arts. That song inter interesting. Interesting. That sound inter interesting. <laughs> because I have never been in one of those e events. Yes. So I, I need to practice. Don't worry, little by little. 
So, will you go with, with me? Perfect. I like it, Anita. <laughs> yes, where do we meet? Well, the event is in, in this next Saturday at, at 4 p.m. So what do you think if, if we meet there? Perfect. Perfect. You'll be there. I'll, and, I'll, I'll. I'll, I'll be there. I'll be there and thanks for inviting me. Anytime, my friend. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Woo. Excellent. Next, next, okay. next. Okay. Catherine, okay. play test. Next, next, next. Okay. Hi, Roxana. How's it going? I'm pretty good. What's new? Nothing. Has a lot of work. Just. Has no. Just. Just. He has a lot of work. Perfect. I can imagine. I can imagine. Imagine, no. Imagine. Imagine, imagine. Así como la canción de los Beatles. Imagine. imagine all the people. Okay? Imagine. Okay. Imagine. I can imagine. Excellent. I can imagine. Hey, listen. Do you have plans next weekend? Wow. No, you what what Why you ask? Perfect, Catherine. I like to invite you to us as for events. Event. Would you like to go event? Yes. Sure. I don't have anything to do on the weekend. Yes. What what kind of a sport event? Event. Event. Is it? Is it? It's, it's about it, it, what? it's about martial arts. That's so in, interesting because I have never been in one of those events. 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 Perdón. Yeah. Events. Little valero, little valero, little valero. What's so interesting because I have never been in one of those events. Events. Events, perdón, events. Ahora, el héroe vale. Nos está batallando, ¿verdad? Yes. What's so interesting because I have never been in one of those events. 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 <risa> Ay, Dios santo. <risa> Como con ese al final. No, es que estás diciendo event y es la fuerza de voz para las event. Event. event, ok, event. y tú estás diciendo event, event, event. ok, it's not even, okay. it's event, event, yes, event, event, yeah, event. event. Right. What's so interesting because I have never been been in one of those events. Perfect. So will you go with me? Ooh, yeah. Yes. Where do we meet? Perfect. Well, the event. No. Is in... <laughs> I know. Event. Event. <laughs> well, the event. Okay. Well, the event is in, <laughs> is in Indies next Saturday at 4 p.m. So, what do you think if we meet there? Perfect. I'll I'll be there and thanks for inviting me. Anytime my friend. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Excellent. That's good. Little by little. Okay, don't worry. Hoy vamos a hoy vamos a hacer más de esto. Okay, para derrotar esa palabra event. <laughs> All right, little by little. Imagine. <laughs> Imagine, 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 okay, imagine, imagine, no, imagine, imagine all the people, okay, like that. Teacher, yes, yes, no, it all, no, it all, no, it all, no, it all, okay. Un no, no, at all. no at all. 
Ero. Y yo como con E. No... Correcto, no Ero. Así se va a pronunciar, okay. no Ero. Todo unido, no, no Ero. ero. Y, y la no, mía, no. Estoy mal, no Tarol. Not at all, not at all, not at all, not at all, not at all. Okay, pero ya no se dice, lo que pasa es que ya no tienes, ya no puedes decir not at all, not at all. Sino que ya cuando hablas se dice no at all. Ya la T es como una R y la segunda y la A, primera A suena como una E. Ok, entonces se dice no at all. Así de loco es el inglés, ok. Yes. Cuando se une todo, nada pega, ¿va? Right? Eso es una pronunciación totalmente distinta, no at all. Sí. Yes, ya no se dice not at all, ¿ok? Ya nada que ver, ¿ok? Ya todo Y just es just, ¿verdad? Just. Just, just. Just. Es como una Y, una O, una S y una T, just. Just a lot. Just a lot of work, a lot of work. Aquí ya se une a también. A lot of, a lot of work, a lot of work, a lot of work. A lot of work. Correcto. Y la yes. F, y la F casi que desaparece cuando ya empieza a decir just a lot of work, just a lot of work, just a lot of work. Ok. Esa F ya cuando empieza a decirse ya desaparece. Just a lot of work, just a lot of work. Ok, like that. Yes. Okay. Here we go one more time. Alice, Alice of the powers. Little by little. Little by little, teacher. Oh my God, I was watching, okay, the, the or, 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 okay, like that, right, like that. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> how do you pronounce this word? Or, and how do you pronounce this word? Our, and how do you pronounce this or? Or. <laughs> that was really good. That was a lot of fun. I was okay laughing a lot. All right, two, one, go. Okay, perfect. All right, guys. Uh, there we Catherine played this. Okay, we were, uh, she was asking me about different pronunciation. That was good. Good question. Teacher, how do you pronounce this one? So this one right here, pronunciation, we're going to put some color. Okay, se pronuncia así, just. Okay, that's the pronunciation, just. Okay, just. Okay, just a lot of work. Just a lot of work. Okay, eh, lo otro que me preguntó también era de esta. Okay, a lot of work. Okay, so esta de aquí, prácticamente la letra F casi que desaparece cuando decimos eso. A lot of, a lot of work. So, la letra F casi ni se oye. Just a lot of work. Just a lot of work. ¿Ok? Ya no se pronuncia la F. Just a lot of work. Teacher. Yes. Eh, sobre la pronunciación. En otras vez, en otras ocasiones, eh, se pronunciaba a lot. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Muchas gracias. Eh, la, yes. la, 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 la A. Eh, en vez de O y en esta ocasión ¿por qué lot? Ok si si tú me dijeras hey George uh, ¿cuánto tenemos de comida? entonces yo te, yo te tendría que decir a lot ok la O se convierte en una A a lot ok ok pero en este caso ya tenemos esta otra palabra acá, ¿ok? Entonces, ya esto ya no se convierte, ya, ya, just a lot of work, just a lot, a lot of work. Entonces, tendría que ir en, con una vocal O porque ya tenemos esta, a lot of, a lot of work. Just a lot of work. Dependiendo de la frase, así va a ser, que va a cambiar a una A o si no, a una O, A. Por una O. ¿Adrián? Sí, estoy escuchando. Ok. ¿Any other question? No, solo hay un poquito sobre eso. Y que en español 
eh, diría exactamente cómo. Nada. ¿Solo? Solo mucho trabajo. Solo mucho trabajo, así. Ya, yeah, solo mucho trabajo. Okay. Solo mucho trabajo. Ok, like that. El otro que me preguntó Catherine, ok, es esta. Ok, not at all. Pero ya no se dice así, not at all. No se dice not at all. Se dice y se pronuncia así. No, ok, no at all. No, no. Ok, no at all. Ok, as, no at all. No at all. No at all. No, no at all. Ok, like that. Así se pronuncia. Ok, no at all. De estas tres, ok, se unen para decir no at all. Ok, nada que ver, ok. Cuando se hace une, nada que ver de las tres palabras. No at all. Ok, una aliación de tres palabras. Ok, so, y esta de aquí, with me, ok. Otra, que aquí tengo la pronunciación, ok, que se dice with me. Okay? Se la he puesto ahí para que pronuncien la Z, with me. Okay? Yeah, with me. Siempre la Z se va a pronunciar en medio de los dientes. With me, with me, with me. Okay? Would you go with me? Would you go with me? Ok. Would you go with me? Would you go with me? Ok. Eso cuando se pronuncia, would you go with me? Ok. Pero ya cuando se hace un poco más de fluido, oiganlo bien. Listen. Will you go with me? Will you go with? Ok. Will you go with me? Ya desaparece la Z. Cuando se hace con la pronunciación más rápida. Hey, will you go with me? Hey, Alicia, will you go with me? Desapareció la Z también. ¿Ok? O sea que de las dos formas puede ser. Correcto, correcto. ¿Ok? Hay unas personas que hablan más rápido que otras. Unas pronuncian la Z y otros no la pronuncian. ¿Ok? Alguien te puede decir, hey, Catherine, will you go with me? Ahí oíste la Z. Will you go with me? Y otras veces te van a decir, hey, Catherine, will you go with me? Will you go with me? With me, with me, with me. O oh, like that. So, así de loco okay. es. Yes, tell me. Uh, invite you, podría. Okay. Invite you, okay. Esta otra también, sí, ahí me preguntaron. Okay, invite you. Esta la vamos a poner aquí. Invite you, okay. Invite you. Invite you, okay. Vamos a ponerlo separado. Invite you. Okay, invite you. Así se va a pronunciar. I invite you. Okay. Invite you. Okay. No se dice you. Se dice invite you. Invite you. Invite you. Invite you. Invite you. Invite you. Okay. Correct. Okay. I like to invite you. Okay. I like to invite you to Sporty Bay. I like to invite you to Sporty Bay. I like to invite you to Sporty Bay. I like to invite you. Invite you. Invite you. Invite you. All right, you, you, okay, invite you. Okay? Here we go. Invite you. Any other? Otra? Ah, esta nos está dando problemas. Ayer la vimos, okay? Kind, okay? Acuérdense, esta es kind. Kind, okay? Aquí le vamos a poner. Kind, okay? What kind of sport event is it? All right, like that. Ok, guys, so basically that's the pronunciation, ok, ahí le tenemos un poco de pronunciación, ok, para que no se nos pierda, ok, so you don't get lost. Uh, ok, let's continue. Vamos a pronunciar esto one more time. ¿Cómo lo vamos a hacer? Like I was telling you, this format is for any invitation, es para cualquier invitación, ok, for any, any invitation. Ya lo vamos a ver, ¿a dónde? Aquí. Here we go, check it out. So here we have this other activity about invitation conversations. Y como les he estado diciendo, es la misma, ¿ok? Es el mismo formato para cualquier invitación. ¿Para qué tipo de invitaciones? What kind of invitation? Invita inviting your friend to the beach, inviting your friend to the museum, inviting your friend to the cinema, inviting your friend to go shopping, inviting your friend to an art exhibition, inviting your friend to a restaurant, inviting your friend to a concert, inviting your friend to a birthday party. 
So, is the same format. Is the same format. Lo vamos a hacer en este momento, ¿ok? So, here we go. Y miren, tiene la misma estructura, ¿ok? Lo único que va a cambiar es a dónde vamos a ir. A un bar, a un restaurante, al cinema, beach, at exhibition, shopping, concert, or bird party. So, here we go. Vamos a practicarlo. Voy a ir uno por uno, ¿ok? So, here we go with... Adrián, tú, Adrián, primero. Ready? I'm here. Ready? Okay, here we go. Hi, Adrián, how's it going? I'm pretty good. What's new? Nothing, just a lot of work. I can Thank imagine. You. Hey, listen, do you have plans next weekend? No, at all. Why you ask? I'd like to invite you. I like to invite you to the beach, to the beach. Okay. Sure, I don't have anything to do on the weekend, but what beach are we going to? Tunco Beach. Oh, that sounds interesting because I've never been in that beach. So, we, so, will you go with me? Yes, where do we meet? Well, that you that you seen excuse me well what do you think if we meet at 8 p.m yeah. okay eh, y aquí me tendrías que decir vamos a ponerlo aquí okay vamos a hacerlo aquí if we meet at okay pero antes tiene que tener esto aquí okay Dime el lugar donde quieres que nos encontremos. Ahí, ¿a qué horas? Action. Well, do you, well, do you think we meet in El Paro at 8 p.m.? 8 p.m. to go to the beach. In the night. Okay. Perfect. All right. I, I don't have anything to do on the weekend. Perfect. I'll be there. And thanks for inviting me. <laughs> Let me down, my friend. Goodbye. Hey, see you next Saturday. Bye-bye. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Excellent. All right. El Tunco Beach. Okay. It's El Tunco Beach. Correcto. Allá a las ocho de la noche empieza todo. All right. That's good. That's good. Next one. Okay. Vamos a ir con Elizabeth. Elizabeth, ready? Yes. Okay, now you start. Uh, hi, teacher. Hi. How's it going? I'm pretty good. What's you? Nothing. You saw lots of work. Hey, listen. I can imagine. Hey, listen. Do you have plans next weekend? Do you have plans next weekend? Not at all. But what do you ask? Otra vez. No at all. No at all. No. What do you ask? I like to invite you to the museum. I like to invite you to a museum. Would you like to go? Sure. I don't have anything to do on the weekend. But what uh, museum we are going to go? Oh, Marte Museum. That sounds interest interesting because I have never been in that uh, Marte Museum. Okay, so would you go with me? Yes, where do we meet? Well, what do you think we meet in front of Cisco at 2 p.m.? Perfect. I'll be there and thanks for inviting me. Inviting me. Inviting me. Anytime, my friend. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Perfect. Okay. Next si ustedes Saturday. ven, es el mismo formato. Para dos invitaciones distintas. Vamos a hacer una más para que vean cómo va. So, I'm going to do this, okay, with Claudita. Oh, no, 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 okay, Claudita. I'm sorry, vamos a ver a Billy, 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 okay. <laughs> Billy, Billy. Bye. Okay. Here we go, Billy. You start, tú empiezas. Okay. Hi, teacher, how's it going? I'm pretty good, what's new? Nothing, just a lot of work. I can, of work. I can imagine. Hey, listen, do you have plans next weekend? No, that's all. 
Oh, will you ask? Otra vez, no at all. No, no at all. No at all. Otra vez, no at all. No at all. No at all. Will you ask? Excellent. I like to invite you to, y vamos a seguir aquí, dice que al cinema. I like to okay. invite you to the cinema. Would you like to go? Sure, I don't have anything to do on the weekend, but the cinema, what cinema are we going to go? Ah, oh, that's a good question. What do you think we go to La Gran Vía cinemas? That song that is in the car, I have never been in the dish in the cinema La Gran Vía. Perfect. So, what do we meet? Well, what do you think if we meet at uh, 3 p.m.? No, yes. me tienes que decir donde quieres que nos reunamos. Okay. Well, what do you think if we meet at uh, La Gran Vía at 3 p.m.? Perfect. Okay, I'll be there in 10 uh, for being there, okay? With me. Goodbye. Anytime, my friends. Goodbye. Okay, see you next Saturday. That's good. All right, guys. So that's the way that we do it. Okay. Al final, yo me salté una línea, pero no nos regresamos porque igual era una conversación. Okay. Al final, yo le tenía que decir a dónde nos íbamos a encontrar, pero como me salté una línea, era para que vieran de que no cambiaba la conversación. Siempre es esa conversación. Okay. Siempre tienen que seguirla y al final, pues siempre acordamos en, en reunirnos y vernos en algún lugar. Uh, una hora. All right, guys. So that's what we're going to do. ¿Cuántas invitaciones, conversaciones vamos a hacer? How many invitation conversations are we going to do? We're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. No significa que las vamos a terminar todas. Significa que le vamos a poner fluidez. Ok, for the pronunciation. Le vamos a poner fluidez para la pronunciación. What pronunciation? ¿Cuál pronunciación? How's it going? Pretty good. A lot of work. Imagine. No at all. Uh, invite you. Ok. Y de ahí todas las demás que siguen. Ok. Y esta también de aquí. Thanks for inviting me. Ok. So we're going to put fluency para pronunciar todas esas frases. What's the other objective? ¿Cuál es el otro objetivo? Practicar el would you like to, ok? Ese es el otro objetivo, ok? To practice the expression and the structure, would you like to? Ok, guys, take a picture. Yes, tell me. En la línea, I'd like to invite you to a, no me queda muy claro eh, en español. Me gustaría invitarte a un museo, a... Un cine a un, ok, a centro, centro comercial e ir, ir de, de compras. Compra. Correcto, ir de compras. Invitarte a, ok, una exhibición de arte, pero aquí ya no vas a decir a, sino que tendrías que decir an. To an art exhibition, to a restaurant, to a concert, y aquí también a uh, birthday, to no, a birthday no basta party. Con el, no basta con el tú, siempre es tú a o tú a. Correcto, porque estás hablando de una actividad, de un lugar. Ok. To the beach, aquí está. ¿vale? No tendrías que decir A. Ah, tendrías que decir, I'd like to invite you to the beach. I'd like to invite you to the museum. To the museum. To the museum. I'd like to invite you to a cinema. O puedes decir to the cinema. To go shopping. To an art exhibition. To a restaurant. To a concert, to a birthday party. Así se hace. Roxy? Yes, thank you. No me queda claro. No me yes. queda claro. Excuse me. Eh, vamos a hacer cuántas invitaciones. Aquí está. Todas. Correcto. Todas las vamos a hacer. No sé si las van a terminar o no. Lo más importante, como les digo, son dos cosas. Lo más import Aquí dice que son ocho. Pero lo más importante es de que le vamos a poner fluidez, una. And the second objective, que practiquemos el would like to, 
¿Ok? Would like to. Y la pronunciación de las otras frases que hemos estado practicando. ¿Ok? So, I'm going to give you only six minutes. Le voy a dar solo seis minutos. ¿Ok? For this activity. Oh, oh, oh. Teacher. Yes. ¿Puede poner la, la, la presentación anterior donde estaban como la pronunciación? Esa que quiero que yes. Ya la capturé. Excelente. ¿Ok? Thank you. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Que son las mismas pronunciaciones que están aquí, mm -hmm. pero mm -hmm. de distinto lugar. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Here we go. ¿Ok? Action. We are 12 right now. Perfect. Ok, en una Recreate this. Recreate, initiate. Ok, guys. Acuérdense, only six minutes. Solamente seis minutos. Lo más importante, la fluidez. Y lo otro, practicar el would like to. Esas dos. No es a terminar todas las, ok, todas las invitaciones. Fluency and using would like to. That's the most important thing. Action. Click on the invitations. All right, Catherine, play test. Action, action. All right. All right, all right. Here we go. One more time. So basically what the students are going to do right now into the rooms, they're going to practice, okay, eight different conversations, okay, for eight different places. But the most important thing about this activity basically is, number one, pronunciation. Number two, fluency in the flow, okay, to be spontaneous. Number three, to practice the structure, like two into a conversation. So let's go and check them out right now. Yes. Uh, Okay. Hi, Omar. This is it para hacer yo la invitación. I am pretty good. What needs? What's new? What's new? Nothing. Just a lot of work. Otra vez, más fluido. Just a lot of work. Just a lot of work. Okay. Nothing. Just a lot of work. Perfect. Hey, listen, do you have plan next weekend? No, at all. With you ask. Why you ask? Why you ask? What do you ask? Why? Why? You why? Ask? why you ask? Why you ask? Uh, I like to invite you to restaurant. Well, you like to go. Perfect. Sure, I don't have anything to do the weekend, but what restaurants are going to go? Perfect. Uh, sushi time? Woo. That's so <laughs> interesting. Interesting. Perfect. <laughs> Interesting because I have never been in restaurant. In that restaurant. So, that restaurant. so will you go with me? With me. Perfect. So will you go with me? Yes. Will you with me? Perfect. Will you with me? Perfect. Well, what do you think and with me um Pan Cuscatlan in Metro Centro at uh, one PA there? Perfect. I'll be there and thanks for inviting me. I'm there, my friends. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Excellent. Oh, my. That's good. Ahora Omar empieza, okay, para que Carlita Verónica invite. Action. Okay. Use a lot of work. Mande? Okay. 
Iniciemos nuevamente. Va, está bien. Uh -huh. Hi, Ana María. How's it going? I'm pretty good. What's new? Nothing. Use a lot of words. I can imagine. Hey, listen. Do you have plans next weekend? No, that out. Well, will you ask? I'd like to invite you to a uh, um, free day party. Would you like to go? Sure, I don't have anything to do on the weekend, but what? Uh, what? Free day party. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a party. <laughs> Are we going to go? Oh, uh, the birthday party, my son. That's of my so, son. That's so interesting because I have never been to that party. So, will you go with, with me? Yes. Would you? Where do we meet? Well, do you do you think if we meet at my house and at 5 p.m.? Perfect. Perfect. I'll be there and thanks for inviting me. Inviting me. Inviting me. Anything, my friend. Goodbye. Anytime. Anytime. <laughs> Anytime, my friend. Goodbye. Excellent. See you next Saturday. Bye. Excellent. There you go. Little by little, step by step. Yes, where where do we turn? Yes, where do we meet? Well, what do you meet? We meet at uh, four p.m. there. Perfect. I'll be there. And thanks for inviting me. Anytime, my friend. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Vaya. Hoy yo le pregunto, verdad? Porque bueno, usted me acaba de preguntar. Hi, Catherine. How's okay. it going? I am pretty good. What's new? Nothing. Just a lot of work. I, I can imagine. Hey, listen. Do you have plans ne next weekend? Well, why do you guys? I uh, like to um, invite you to um, our exhibition. exhibition. <laughs> our exhibition. And Would our you like to go? Sure. I don't have anything to do on the weekend, but why exhibition? Going to go? I'll be going to go. Catedral. That sounds. That sounds interesting because I had never been in the in that uh, situation. So will you go with me? Yes. Where do you meet? Well, what do you think if we meet Catedral um, at um, 3 p.m. there? Perfect. I'll be there on the 10th for inviting me. Anything, my friend. Goodbye. See you next Saturday. Bye. Excellent, I like it. Good job. Okay.
Okay, that's good, pretty good. Right, right, guys. Excellent. I was listening to some of you. Excellent job. Okay, good pronunciation. You were applying all these aliations, okay, into these phrases. That's good. That's good. I really like it. <laughs> Pero <malino. laughs> yes, step by step. Correct. Okay, perfect. Everybody's here right now. Yes, okay, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, okay, okay. That's good. All right, guys. Excellent job. Okay, so those are the different invitations. Okay, using one format. Okay, el mismo formato, the same format para cualquier invitación. Okay, here in El Salvador in Japan is the same format. Very easy, very simple. Correct, Alicia. Correct. All right. Guys, let's continue with the agenda. So we were here, different invitations. Number one, fluency. Number two, the flow, how to go and answer, okay? Telling these expressions as well. Number three, okay? Practicing, okay? Would like to, okay? That was the other objective. All right, guys, do you have questions? No questions? Let's continue. Creating conversations using would like to, okay? So that's what we did, okay? La estuvimos haciendo acá, okay? Fueron a los rooms y la estuvieron haciendo. Ustedes decidían si hacer la invitación to the beach or go shopping or restaurant or birthday party or any of them, okay? So it was your decision. So next one, expressions with could, okay? So according to the agenda right here, it says practicing conversations using could for polite requests, okay? So here we go. So first, we have these expressions. Tenemos estas expresiones. We have these expressions using could. The meaning of could is podría. Eso significa could, podría. Okay? Es el significado del could, podría. Excuse me, could you help me, please? Podría ayudarme, por favor? Could you help me, please? Could you do me a favor? ¿Cómo sería en español, Rubidia? Could you do me a favor? Podría? Correct. Podría hacerme un favor, all right? Could you do me a favor? Otra vez, Rubidia, reivindícase. Could be possible if you can help me? Podría ser? Rubidia? Podría ser. Like in Spanish. Like in Spanish. Posiblemente. Posible. No, posible. Podría ser posible. Could be possible. If. Sí. El if significa sí. ¿Ok? ¿Podría sí uh, ayudarme? Correcto. Right? Podría ser posible. Right? Sí. Posible? ¿Puede, ayudarme? Puede ayudarme. That's good. Billy, Billy. Could you call me tomorrow? Ser, podría ser posible que tú me ayudaras. También podría ser, ¿verdad? ¿vale? Ok, ¿podría ser posible que tú me ayudaras? Yes, perfecto. Lo que es if suena algo raro en español. Podría ser, podría ser posible si tú me puedes, puedes ayudar. Puedes, me puedes ayudar. Puedes ayudar, sí. ayudar sí. Ok, ¿podría ser posible si me puedes ayudar? Sí, si, sí, si me puedes ayudar. Así sería la traducción. Ok, like that. Thank you, Roxy. That's good. Ahí vamos. Next one, Billy, could you call me tomorrow? Podría llamarme mañana. Excellent. Could you have could we have lunch together, Carlita? Could we have lunch together? Podría ser. Podríamos. Podríamos. Hacer. No, podríamos. Almuerzo. No, podríamos almorzar. Almorzar. 
juntos. Juntos. Podríamos Correct. almorzar juntos. Correcto. Catherine, could you send me the reports, please? Yeah. Podrías enviarme el reporte, por favor. Perfect. Next one, okay. Um, Claudita, could you buy some groceries for me? Alimentos. Golosina. Alimentos, correct. Alimentos sería mejor. Podría comprarme alimentos para mí. Okay, okay, that's good. Could we meet to talk? Okay, could we meet to talk? Adrián, could we meet to talk? ¿Podrías eh, hablarme? Podríamos. Podríamos conocernos para hablar. ¿Cómo? Reunirnos. Conocernos para hablar. No, reunirnos. Adrián, el MIT tiene dos significados. Es conocernos y reunirnos. Ok. Ok. Could we meet to talk? Podríamos right. reunirnos para hablar. Correct, correct, all right. Next one. Could I see you today, Roxy? Podría, podría verte ahora. Podría verte hoy. Correct, today, yes. And the last one, Anita Alvarado. Could you stop by the office to plan the project? Podrías detenerte en la oficina para planear el proyecto. Correct, planear o planificar. Excellent. That's good, Anita. All right, guys, so those are the different expressions that we have, okay, using could. Omar, dímelas todas. Pronunciation. Excuse me, Carl, you had me, please? Okay, okay, vamos a detenernos ahí. Okay. La pronunciación de esa palabra, okay, la vamos a identificar en este momento, okay. Esta palabra de aquí se va a pronunciar así. Could. Así could. se va a pronunciar. Se va a pronunciar could. La O y la L no se pronuncian. ¿Ok? Very easy, very simple. Could. ¿All right? Could. ¿All right? Esa va a ser la pronunciación. Could. Ok, here we go. Otra vez. Omar. One more time. Okay. Excuse me. Could you help me, please? Perfect. Could no. you do... No. Could you do me? Could you do me? Could you do me? Could you do me um, I fiber? Could be, Could be possibly and uh, you can help me? Could be possible. Could be possible. 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 Otra vez, possible. Okay. Could be possible and you can... I know if... If... If this... You can help me. Otra vez. Could be possible if you can help me. Can, no. Can. Otra vez. Can. <laughs> uh, could be possible if you can... Can help me? All right, continue. Could you call me tomorrow? Perfect, next one. Could we have lunch together? Excellent, next one. Excellent. Could you send me the report, please? Next. Could could you buy some groceries for me? That's correct. Could we meet to tall? No, otra vez. Tall. Otra vez. Could we, could we meet no. to tall? ¿Cómo es la pronunciación? Aquí la tenemos, aquí tall. la tenemos. Aquí está. Could we meet to tall? Perfect. Could. Could I see you today? All right. Could you stop by the office to plan the project? Okay, that's good, Omar. Little by little, step by step. 
And I like it, all right. All right, guys, that's the pronunciation about could, could, could. All right, so that's the pronunciation. Yes, Adrian. Uh, in ese caso, could you buy some groceries? Es también comprar abarrotes, Correcto. por ejemplo. Alimentos, abarrotes, a la cena. Eso, eso significa. Okay, gracias. That's good, that's good, excellent. Next one, okay, we're going to have the attendance in this moment. All right, so everybody with the cameras on, okay. Mercy, no mercy today. Adrien, si sí, ganan. Present. Excellent. Present. Present. I don't stand Lee Mejia. No. Okay. Catherine, please. Yes. Present. Excellent. All right. Next one. Jose Mario. Okay. Ramirez. No. Okay. Next one. Claudita Ordonez. That's good. Ana Maria Alvarado. Presente. All right. Carla Veronica Arias. Present. That's good. Catherine Lozano. No. Catherine Vasquez. No. Oh, I see Fredo Mar Salmeron. Present. That's good. Josué Rosales. Present. That's good. Billy Peña. Present. Okay. Gloria Noemi Alfaro. Not today. Okay. Jose Guillermo Pasolano. No today. Elizabeth Mendez, the teacher, Pineda. Present teacher. All right. Alice Handel, Colorado. Present. I like it. All right. Janet Lara. No Janet today. Roxy, Roxana Cornejo. Present teacher. Excellent. And Rubidia Castillo. Present, sure. All right, that's good. That's the attendance. All right, guys, let's continue with the class. So here we go. So we are right now here, okay, into the pronunciation and the definition of could is podrías, okay? Podría, podrías, podríamos, okay? That's basically the meaning of could, depending on the subject. All right, guys, pero no solamente las oraciones nos sirven, Hay que ver cómo las utilizamos. So here we go. Number one. Conversation number one, using good informal requests. Okay? En solicitudes formales. Okay? So here we go. Con la, aquí hay una expresión. Could you buy some grocery for me? Ya lo utilizamos en una conversación. Alicia. Okay. And Adrián. Conversation. Hi, Adrián. How's it going? All is great. Otra vez, Adrián. All is great. Great. All is great. Perfect. Where are you heading? Correcto. ¿Para dónde vas? Eso significa. ¿Para dónde vas? Eso significa. Where are you heading? ¿Para dónde vas? I'm going to the market. Could you buy some groceries for me? Sure. What do you need? Some fish and water. A bottle. Yes. And a bottle? A bottle. Okay. Some fish and a bottle of vinegar. Vinegar. Be vinegar. vinegar. Yes, mm -hmm. vinegar. Okay. I will. I call you when I back. Thanks. Anything. That's good, all right? A bottle of vinegar. ¿Qué significa vinegar? Vinagre. Vinagre, correct. Vinegar. Vinagre. Correct. A bottle of vinegar. Next one. Next conversation. This one right here. Could we have lunch to the, uh, together today at? Es una de las expresiones que hemos visto hoy. Okay? Lunch together. Lea la tenemos aquí en una conversación. In this moment, we go with Josué. All right, Josue and Elizabeth. Action. Hi, Elizabeth, who is speaking? No. Hi, who's speaking? Hi, who's speaking? It's me. How are you doing? Okay, aquí tienes que decir Elizabeth. Lo vamos, a, vamos a ver. Vamos a arreglar esto. Okay, let me see. Boom. Okay. Ahí le faltó algo a eso. Ok, who's speaking? Vamos aquí. Okay. So, 
hi, coma, who's speaking? Ok, it's me y aquí dices tu nombre, ok. Hi, who's speaking? Hola, ¿quién habla? Es una llamada telefónica. Hi, who's speaking? Hola, ¿quién habla? A while like that. Here we go. Action, one more time, Josué. Hi, who's speaking? It's me, Elizabeth. How are you doing? All is great. What's you? Not much. Just the same thing. The same thing. The same thing. Hey, could you have lunch together? No, I, siempre Elizabeth, siempre Elizabeth, siempre Elizabeth, siempre Elizabeth. Hey, could, could we have lunch together today at 1.30 p.m.? What do you think? Okay, cool. Where do we meet? At the steakhouse and it goes on me, okay? Thanks. Don't mention it. See you. Perfect, ok, vamos a arreglar eso, ok. Ok, cool, where do we meet? At the state house, and it goes on me. Pero aquí está, había un error, aquí está. Aquí hay un error, ok. What do you think? Uh, what, what do you what, think? What do you think? ¿Qué te parece? What do you think? Ok, cool, ok. Ok, cool significa, ok, está bien, genial. Ok, cool, where do we meet? At the state house. Ok, state house significa, es el nombre del restaurante, restaurante. correcto. Red at the steakhouse. It goes on me. Okay, it goes on me. Significa yo pago. Eso significa it goes on me. Okay, yo pago. Okay, it goes on me. Y la otra persona dice, thanks, don't mention it. Okay, el don't mention it significa you're welcome. De nada. Eso significa el don't mention it. Uh, okay. Otra forma de decir you're welcome. Okay. Esa es otra forma de decir, you're welcome. Don't mention it. All right? You're welcome. See ya. Ahí te veo. See ya. Esa es una forma informal de decir, see you later. See ya. Ahí te veo. OK, like that. All right, guys. Next conversation. OK, here we go. This one goes, Billy, Billy. OK, Billy, Billy. And Catherine, play this. Action. Good morning, Mr. Cesena. Good morning, Miss Hidalgo. Could you stop by to plan the project? Sure. What time? Around 3 p.m. after the conference. Perfect. I'll be there. Do you need the airport? Of course. Thanks for reminding remind me. Reminding, reminding me. Bye. Goodbye. Perfect. Okay, vamos a ir. Could you stop by the office? Okay, like that. Falta eso ahí. Could you stop by the office to plan the okay, project? Okay. Podrías detenerte por un momento en la oficina, en la oficina, en mi oficina, okay, to plan the project, para planificar el proyecto. Okay, what time? Around 3 p.m. A eso de las 3 p.m. After the conference, después de la conferencia. Okay, perfect, I'll be there. Do you need the report? Of course, claro que sí. Thanks, I'm sorry, ahí tenemos otro error. Okay, it's thanks. Okay, thanks for, okay, thanks for reminding me. Esta de aquí, okay, significa, gracias por recordarme. Thanks for reminding me. Thanks for reminding me. Gracias por recordarme. Así se dice en español. Thanks for reminding me. Thanks for reminding me. Gracias por recordarme. Thanks for reminding me. Bye. Goodbye. Like that. So three conversations, ¿ok? Aquí vamos otra vez. Vamos a empezar desde acá, ¿ok? Vamos a poner a Claudita. Are you ready, Claudita? Yes. Excelente. Claudita en Josué. Las tres de una sola vez. Action. Okay. Hi, Josue. How's it going? All is great. What are you doing? I'm going to the market. The market. You could to buy some grocery for me? Sure, what do you need? 
from fish and a bottle of bottle. vinegar. Bottle vinegar, bottle vinegar, bottle vinegar. From fish and bottle of bottle vin vinegar. <laughs> Uh, okay, I will. I'll call you when I am back. Thanks. Anytime. Okay, now you, Jose, you start. Hi, who is speaking? Hey, Claudia. How did you find? All is great. What's new? Not much. Just the same thing. Hey. Could we have lunch together today at 1, 1 3.15 p.m.? What do you think? Okay, cool. Where do we meet? At the, at the state house. house. And it goes, it goes, it goes, it goes on me, it goes on me. It goes on me, okay? It goes on me, okay? Thanks. The question is easier. See, so, yeah, correct. Right. Next one. You start, okay, Claudita. Good morning, Mr. Ceseña. Good morning, Mr. Hidalgo. Miss. Miss, 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 miss. <laughs> Do you stop by the office to plan the project? Sure, what time? Around 3, 3 p.m. after the conference. Perfect, I'll be there. Do you need the report? Of course. No. Thanks. La U no se pronuncia. Claudita, la U no se pronuncia. Of course. Thanks for reminding Remind. me. Reminding me, reminding me. Reminding me. Bye. Goodbye. Okay, guys, perfect. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna practice, okay, three conversations using good informal request. Okay, take a picture. One, two, three, four. Take a picture. Next one, okay. This one. One, two, three. Four and this one. One, two, three, four. Okay, are you ready? Yes. yes. Here we go. Time for action. Okay, guys, I'm gonna put you into the rooms in this moment. Three conversations using good for formal requests. We are okay. Twelve. That's good. That's good. I like it. Six is perfect for me. Recreate and initiate. Okay, click on the invitations, practice three conversations using kids for formal requests. Action, action, fluency. All right, Adrian, go, go, go. Okay, perfect, Adrian. All right, guys, so basically what the students are doing right now, they are practicing three conversations using cool, okay, for formal request. So let's go and check them out right now. I'm gonna go here. Sure, what do you need? Some fish and um, bottle of vinegar. Vinegar. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Okay, I will like to go back. Thanks. Thanks. Anytime. Wait to be asses. Wait to be asses. How do you say hoy tu empiezas in English? Now you start. Now you start. Correct. Ahora tu empiezas. Now you start. Now you start. Okay. 
Hi, Alisa. What's going on? Alice Gray. No, esa ah, suena como... Alice Gray. Ah, suena, excellent. Excuse me. Could you help me? I'm going to the market. Could you buy some grocery for, for me? Sure. What sure. do you need? Some fish and butter. Vinegar. 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 Okay, I will. I call you when I back. When I back. Thanks. Anytime, anytime. Good, Alice. I like it. I'm going to choose all the students right now. I'm going to go with Catherine Plates to check on. Could you buy some grocery for me? Sure. What do you need? Some fish and butter of vinegar. Okay. I will. I'll call you when I'm back. Thanks. Anytime. Okay. Yes. Hi, who's, who's speaking? It's me, Giselle. How are you doing? No, how are you doing? No. Así se puede decir, pero ¿cómo, se, cómo lo estamos practicando? How are you doing? How are you doing? That's good. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, it's great. What's new? Not much. Just the same thing. Hey. Who no, we no, have? no, no, no. Ah, no, no. You, Catherine. Continue, Catherine. And could we have lunch together today at one one thirty, one thirty, one thirty, one thirty. One thirty PM. What do you think? Excellent. Okay, cool. Where do we meet? Okay, cool. At the dilo, dilo, Rosa. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Where do you, where do we meet? At the steak house, and it goes on me. <laughs> okay, me trae toda. Thanks. Don't mention it. See ya. Yeah, that's good. Very easy, very simple. I like it. Okay, so. Good fluency, I like it, good pronunciation and everything. Let me just check on this. Uh, you and Billy, Billy, Elizabeth, okay, that's good. Anna Marie and Carlita Veronica. Okay. Thanks. Don't mention it. See ya. Good Ahora morning. comienza usted. Ese mismo, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo se dice? Uh -huh. How do you say in English? Ahora comienza usted. How do you say that in English? Uh, now you you start in you start. You start. Correct. Now you start. That's good. Now you start. Okay. Excellent. I like it. I like. Good, Hi. Anita. Mm. One is speaking. <laughs> no. Who's speaking? Who, who's speaking? Yes. Hi. Who's speaking? Yeah. It's me, Anna. How are you doing? All is great. Great. Otra vez. All is great. What's ahora, new? Ahora unido. All is. All is great. Perfect. I like it, Carlita. Good job. <laughs> that must just stand thin. Yeah. Hey. hey. Hey, it's me and his husband. Hey, how we have lunch together? No, together otra vez. Today hey. and one. Otra vez, Anita. Hey. Okay. Hey, call me have lunch together today at one. Could we have? Could we have? Could we have? Ooh. Otra vez. Hey. hey, could we have? Hey, could we have lunch together today at 1.30 p.m.? What do you think? Excellent. 
Ok, cool. Where do you with me? Otra vez. Ok, cool. Ok, así. Ok, cool. <laughs> ok, cool. Where do you with me? <laughs> Where do we meet? <laughs> meet, ok. Otra vez. Ok, cool. Where do you meet? Where do we? Where do we meet? <laughs> Otra vez. One more time. Ok, cool. <laughs> ok, cool. Where do you with me? Add the steakhouse and it goes on me, okay? Thanks. Don't mention it, see ya. Excellent, I like it. Let's <laughs> go, that's cool. Really cool, really cool. Let me see, just check on cloud detail in Bolivia. Let me just go here. How are you doing? All great. What you? Not much. Just the same thing. Hey, could we have lunch together today at 1.30 p.m.? What do you think? Okay, cool. Where do we meet? Where do we meet? We meet. <laughs> okay, do we meet? No, where do we meet? Where do we meet? Excellent. Okay, where do we meet? Okay, o otra vez. Okay, cool. Where do we meet? Okay, cool. Where do we meet? No, pero no tan triste. Si le está invitando a almorzar. Okay, cool. Okay, así con emoción. Okay, cool. Where do we meet? Okay, like that. Okay, cool. Where do we meet? I like it. And the stay house. And it's. Aquí, teacher, se me olvidó cómo me dijo que se decía. And it goes on me. 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 And it, and it goes. <laughs> yes, and it goes on me. And it goes on me. Así lo voy a poner. And it goes on me. And it goes on me. And it goes on me. On. And it goes on, on me. On me. Así. Excellent. Okay. At the stay house. house and it goes on me, okay? I like it. <laughs> and don't mention it, si ¿Sí, ya? Ok, Claudita, pero no me lo voy a escribir así, oye. No, solo Ay, para pero... acordarme. Yeah. Mire aquí, aquí, aquí. <laughs> of course, that's it for, aquí se nos olvidó también, reminding me. ¿Cómo it's se dice? Reminding me, reminding me. Reminding me. Reminding me. Yeah, thanks for reminding me. Reminding. Thanks for reminding me. Sí, reminding. Yes, thanks for reminding me. Yes. That's good. I like it. Good thinking. Good thinking. I like it. Good thinking. All right, all right, all right. Here we go in the last step of today's class, Alicia. <laughs> Teacher. Yes, Rovidia. Fermentation vinegar? Vinegar. Vinegar. Vinegar, 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 vinegar. Okay. <laughs> vinegar, okay. vinegar. Okay. Cool, excellent job you did today. I really liked it. Excellent. All right, guys. Excellent job. Good pronunciation. Good aliasing of the expression. Buena aliación que hicieron en las frases. I like it. De eso se trata, ¿ok? Estamos aprendiendo una segunda vez esas aliaciones, ¿ok? De algunas palabras, ¿ok? Para ir matando, ¿ok? Todo de un solo tiro. All right, guys. Excellent job. I really liked it. Good pronunciation, good conversation you did today. And let's go to the agenda. Right now we are right here. Okay, estamos acá. This was the last conversation. 
using could, okay? Using could. So let's go to the agenda right here. Agenda, telling personal information, we did it and finish. Practicing useful conversations using would like to. We practice a different conversation, inviting your friend to a different places, but the most important thing was to practice would like to. Next one, practicing conversations using good for polite requests. Three conversations. And create a conversation using could. That's the last activity que nos ha quedado para mañana, okay? Es esta de aquí. Hemos practicado tres conversaciones. One, two, three. Y la que nos va a quedar para mañana es esta. Crear una conversación utilizando could. Pero eso lo vamos a hacer mañana. Don't worry. The most important thing, lo más importante de ahora, es que practicamos esto. To put in practice, would like to, in conversations, and could, for formal requests, in conversations. Okay, guys. Basically, okay. this is it. All right. Excellent job. Uh, vimos, okay. vimos ocho uh, oraciones. Okay. Utilizando could. Hmm, important, really important. Muy importante las, ok, expresiones o las oraciones. Pero más importante, cómo las meto en una conversación, ok? That's the most important thing. ¿Cómo puedo utilizar esa oración en una conversación? Hicimos tres. Mañana van a hacer una a ustedes, ok? Vamos a ver cómo nos va. But for tonight, this is it. ¿Quién se va a quedar conmigo hoy? Try by session. Alice, ¿quién más? ¿Quién más? Roxy, eh, Rubidia, ¿en qué más? ¿Quién más? ¿Quién más? Yo tengo dos preguntas. <ríe> yes. Eh, ¿en, qué, ¿En qué tarea deberíamos de ir ahorita? ¿En qué tarea? Ya, ya las tendría que haber terminado todas, así de fácil. Very easy, very simple. Mm, ok. Eh, Yo voy con la todo, todo, Adrián, la, todo, la, todo. La, la siguiente, eh, no, me enviaron, me enviaron, me enviaron, me enviaron eh, un, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, una nota que me decía de que teníamos que llenar una encuesta. Esa sería el final de la última clase que tenemos. Correcto, el viernes, ok, allá que menciona eso, Adrián, el viernes vamos a hacer eso juntos. No lo vayan a hacer ahorita, tranquilo. El viernes lo vamos a hacer juntos, ¿ok? Y si ya lo hicieron, acuérdense que tenían que haber tomado una fotografía de lo que habían hecho, ¿ok? La like idea. Yes, ahí les explicaba. Pero, ¿ok? El viernes lo vamos a hacer juntos para que no nos perdamos, ¿ok? Very easy, very simple. All right, guys. Excellent job. Gracias por... Adrián. Hola. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's good. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good See you night. tomorrow.